It looks like we are in the midst of the Bronzeby workers' demonstration. Here we are, Watson, 29 strokes alley. By Jove, if it isn't Sherlock Holmes. Hello, Appleby. You're always nearby when there's a whiff of gunpowder in the air, aren't you? Of course, Mr Holmes. Uh, but what are you doing here? Aren't you working with Inspector Lestrade on the Bromsby investigation? Appleby, I have every reason to believe that the murder of Hunter directly relates to that very case. May I ask you to tell me what you know, and then give me leave to examine the scene? Of course, Mr Holmes. What are the facts? Last night, between nine and quarter past nine, a fellow came for me. I was at the pub, which lies a bit further down the lane. He told me that there was the sound of a shot from this bungalow. When we got here, the door was locked. After the landlady got her key, I opened the door. There I saw the dead man lying on the floor. And here we are. What did you do next? Well, Inspector Gregson is in charge of the case. He's due to arrive today to start the official investigation. At least they've removed the body. Do you have any further details about his death? He was killed by a bullet right through his heart. There was just one shot. At first glance, it appears to have been a small calibre weapon. His landlady told me that he was a common fellow with nothing to remark about, no friends to speak of, not even a lady friend. A lonely soul. He has been staying here for two years. The landlady told me he spent most of his time with this flower garden. Indeed, I can't believe that somebody could murder a man because of his eyed rangers. Who has been inside? Only myself and my assistant to help with the removal of the body. The landlady made her identification of the man after he was removed and then left for her sisters. Have you found anything in the room that points to the murderer? For the moment, no. When I entered the first time, the window facing the street was open. I closed it and secured the shutters as well. It is possible to expect anything with those demonstrators in the streets. Does this advance the investigation of the Bromsby case? If you could wait for me here, Watson. Could you open the room for me now, Appleby? Well, 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 what's that? I need something. Oh, he's got it there. It's a trace of human blood. Oh, duh. Strange sketches. Why? What's all of them? This is brand new. This is brand new. Oh. What the... I've come to look around the room and there's nothing here. Although, hang on. There's anything on the floor. Anything here. 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 Watch it, I'll go to the door and he'll say, I've not examined everything, even though I can't seem to examine anything.
don't know. At your service, sir. Thank you, Appleby. At your service, sir. That. Nothing of any interest here. Oh, they stole it. Some of these flowers are not from England. What in the name of reason are you looking for, Holmes? What a curious small flower. Several bills for the sum of £21. Watson, we need to secure the item that was pawned under this ticket with all due haste. Could you take care of it? We shall meet this evening at Sheringford Hall. All right, Holmes. Can you just steal it? Nobody will know. Is it back here? Yeah, it's back right, okay. Nothing there is there. Same place I've just been. I want to go there if I can. No, I'll switch the. At your service, sir. Can you have anything? My dog's having a little bit. Thank you, Appleby. At your service, sir. Must be something in this room, surely. Oh, what's that? Aha! Uh -huh. A golden exotic jewelry. Jewel, even. This is brand new. I know, but it's the only thing I can st I mean, uh, look at. <sighs> oh dear. Yeah, let's see if I can go out of here. I need more information. Oh. 
So I'm obviously missing something. But as usual, I haven't got the foggiest idea on where it could be. I and need something. Bloody new bit. I need something. This footstep is incomplete. It is larger than the size 8, but smaller than a 12. Well, Someone then. used this window to leave. Let us return to Baker Street. Well, before we do, let's save it. We must learn the identity of the dead man discovered in the cement factory. Let's examine his belongings. What do you mean examine his belongings? I ain't got any belongings. even mean a bottle of liqueur from the Richmond Abbey I must have a book that speaks about this Abbey ah. Richmond's Abbey I believe it was built in the 15th century to house an order of Anglican monks. It should surely be there. Let's visit this place, but in disguise. Let's see if this place is located on the map. Before I do, I'm just going to see if I've got anything written on that thing. Ah, oh, okay. Uh, yes it is. It's there. <laughs> Let's visit this place, but in disguise. Okay. Let's visit this place, but in disguise. Trying to find something where I can use for disguise. But I can't. Oh, there's a door. <laughs> awesome. Check out my gigs. Monastery. Yes, my son. 
I am sorry to disturb you, brother, but, uh, well, you see, I have a matter of great importance which led me here, and I am certain that you may be of help. Well, I am looking for my brother. Not a brother like yourself, but rather my brother by birth. He might have joined the order, but I think it is unlikely. You see, he has not always chosen the right path in life. I recently learned that he had had some troubles, and I have been frantic to find him. One of his acquaintances told me that my brother had spoken of Richmond's Abbey. My brother's name is James Little. Perhaps you know of him? Um... If I ask you some questions, would it trouble you? It would at the least help me to learn whether he is here. He is unaware, but recently we received a small inheritance. I think if he were told of this, it would ease his mind and help him put these troubles behind him. This forest is most impressive. It is very large. If someone were to hide in there, it would be most difficult to find them. The Abbey produces a fine liquor, doesn't it? Yes, we distill a liquor that contains medicinal herbs. Oh, yeah. It does allow us a small income, but it also can attract certain rascals. That's why we are mindful of inquisitive strangers. Have there been any burglaries? Oh, we do get the occasional tramp. They sometimes seek shelter in the old ruins that lie in the midst of the forest. They have been known to trespass into our sacred cloister, seeking some sustenance. At least, that is always their tale upon discovery. But it is only the liquor that goes missing. Do you know the way to these ruins? Many paths lead there. If you are prepared for a walk, you may take the path that lies 30 meters in that direction. Thank you very much, Mr. I mean, brother. <laughs> I would not at all be surprised if my brother is discovered to be the architect of your recent thefts, as he may well be hiding within the forest ruins. Sadly, for some time now, he has suffered from an addiction to strong drink. Please allow me to indemnify these losses on my brother's behalf. I'm afraid it will have to come from his share of the inheritance. Goodbye. Good luck, my brother. Thank you, my son. And this is the path we shall go. Not very engaging. No, it's not. And I'm going to click the save button in case I get killed halfway along here. Uh, yeah, you can figure out what time it, the, these are all. I can go no further. Yes, you can, Sherlock. You just drop down here. Go over there, heave yourself up and go over there. Sometimes, you know, you wonder. What can it be? What? What can what be? What am I looking at? Wait, is that curiosity? If I come...
I am being watched. Take heed. Probably by that, uh... I can go no further. Is it near there? I don't know. I'm lost. <laughs> I can go no further. I'm not getting lost or what? I can go no further. <sighs> I can go no further. like this. Dead end, didn't it? Am I right in thinking that one? Have I been down here before? I can't really remember. Yes, I have.
know the dog wants to go out. Right, I am going to be oh, back in a minute. I'm going to have to start again at this. Completely lost. Okay. <laughs> 